Now we are going to learn multiply functions. The product of two functions f and g is defined as f times g of x can be written f of x times g of x. So what is the product of the two functions f of x 9x plus 20 and g of x x plus 5. So remember that ladies and gentlemen to be able to find the product of these two functions f times g of x can be written f of x times g of x. We know what f of x is 9x plus 20 times what is the g of x x plus 5. If we distribute each term in the first parenthesis to the terms in the second parenthesis you will get 9x times x is 9x squared. 9x times 5 is 45x 20 times x 20x 20 times 5 is 100. If you add them up you will get 9x squared combine the like terms plus 65x plus 100 and this is the answer of f times g of x next find f times g where f of x is 3x squared minus 2 and g of x is x squared minus 4x let's do this f times g of x can be written f of g times f of x times g of x if we substitute the expression of f of x, which is given 3x squared minus 2, times g of x is given x squared minus 4x. If we use distribution proper property, you will get that 3x squared times x squared will be 3x to the power of 4. 3x squared times negative 4x will be negative 12x cubed. Negative 2 times x squared will be negative 2x squared. Negative 2 times negative 4x will be positive 8x. If you combine the like terms, ladies and gentlemen, 3x to the power of 4, negative 12x cubed, minus 2x squared, plus 8x. So this is f times g of x. Next, find the product of f and g. Remember that f times g of x can be written f of x times g of x. Let's substitute, substitute the expression of f of x, which is radical x, times what is the g of x? 2x minus 1. If you distribute radical x into the parentheses, you will get 2x times radical x will be 2 x times radical x minus radical x you can leave it answer as it is or you can say that 2x times radical x can be written x to the power one half minus radical x if you come if you multiply this you will get remember that if you multiply two exponent with the same base you need to add powers so this is power 1, the power of the x is 1. So 2 to the power, 2 to 2 times x to the power 3 over 2 minus radical x. And you can also write 2 times radical x cubed minus radical x. Also, correct answer f times g. This is correct answer. Next, what is the product of f of x and g of x? Remember that f times g of x can be written f of x times g of x. Let's substitute. If you substitute f of x, you will get 3x squared minus 3x plus 4 times negative x squared plus 8. You need to distribute each variable in the first parenthesis to the second parenthesis. Let's start with 3x squared. 3x squared times negative x squared will be negative 3x to the power 4. 3x squared times 8 will be positive 24x squared. 
negative 3x times x squared will be positive 3x cubed. Negative 3x times positive 8 will be negative 24x. Now we need to distribute 4. 4 times negative x squared will be negative 4x squared. 4 times 8 will be 32. Now we need to combine like terms. Let's do it. 3x to the power 4. Is there any x to the power 4 for the rest of the expression? No. Negative 3x to the power 4. So this is done. Now the next one is cube. Is there any other x cube into the expression? No. So I leave it. 3x cube. Now x squared. This is 24x squared. This is negative 4x squared. If you combine it, you will get positive 20x squared. So this is done. Now next is x, negative 24x plus 32. So this is your answer. The populations of two species of the birds of birds in a forest can be modeled by the following functions where t is the time in years. What is the function for the combined population and how many birds of both species will there be in five years? So to be able to understand how many total birds, you need to add them up. So which means that f of t plus g of t. We know how to add the two functions. Let me write the f of t first. Negative 10 t squared plus 102 t plus 950 plus negative 5 t squared plus 82 t plus 850. Now we need to add them up. If you add them up, negative 10 t squared, negative 5 t squared, if you add them up, you will get negative 15 t squared. So this is done. Now 102 t plus 82 t. If you add them up, you will get plus 184 t. The last one is 950 plus 850. If you add them up, you will get 1810. So this is F plus G of T. But the question is asking you in five years. So this is the reason we are going to substitute T 5 into the t, which means that I'm looking for f plus g of 5, which means that whenever I see t, I need to substitute 5. Let's do it. Negative 15 times 5 squared plus 184 times 5 plus 1810. 5 squared is 25, 25 times 15 will be negative 375, if you multiply 5 times 184 will be plus 920, then plus 1810, if we add them up, you will get negative 375 plus 2730 if you subtract this you will get 2355 which means that in five years the population the total number of the birds of both species will be 2355